come everyone to join us with just commentary so guys we're gonna react to a video this video is in regards to thai army force military period 2020 very recently of course you guys made this request for this video don't forget please of course subscribe to join us with just commentary like subscribe and if you want me to react don't forget of course leave a comment down below okay thank you so very much let's go ahead and check out this video that you guys have requested let's see give it a bit of brightness Yes, guys, we have we have a we have a, a ring light, so helps make the video brighter and better. Okay, so we've got Royal Thai Armed Forces, Thai Armed Forces, yeah, twenty twenty, very very recently. So of course this should be um, King Armor the tenth, and of course the Queen. And of course the color is yellow. Wow. I've never seen it like that before. Wow. This reminds me of the China version of the military parade. I did not realize that the king and would usually drive across and that the army would stand like this. Wow. This looks so cool. Wow. So they have all the, the presentation of a usual army parade. Salutes, um, gunfires, and of course a huge Thai flag right here. Wow. That's neat. Woo! Whoa! That is neat! I wonder if they have the color flag flying across also. Wow. Of course, the Thai army is a very big army in Thailand. They are there to protect the country of Thailand, the royal family. And of course, the king is the head of the army, the Royal Thai Army. Wow, that is a good presentation right there. Whoa. That is stealth. Oh, they've got horses. Oh, I did not know that they usually use horses. I know for sure Thailand uses a lot of the elephants. I don't think I've ever really seen horses. For matter of fact, this army parade is new. I've not really seen a presentation like that one with King Rama the Ninth. If you guys know of one, send it for me. I would love to see it also. I mainly seen the parade when they're doing the parade on the road, the road parade, but not the king standing and they're passing saluting like that. I have not really seen it like that before. I did not even realize that they have it like that in Thailand. I know in China. They would do that a lot. Well, not a lot, but they would really public and make public this sort of video footage of the army saluting to the king, to the president, sorry, of China, and um, him driving across. So this is actually very new to me. What we've got liberation colors: yellow, green, and red. Wow. These are some stealth looking army vehicles. This one there at the back looks so fast. Wow. So, for you guys in Thailand, what does the color red, green, and yellow mean together? I know usually it means freedom, liberation. Um, this is what it usually portrays, so that's what it usually represents, especially for the Rastafarian community. Yellow, green, red, and sometimes black is called of liberation and freedom. Wow. That is a neat presentation right there. I'm not quite sure if it was a rainy day or something. The weather looks sort of uh, a 
or what would I say that? Not dim, but gloomy, or maybe the quality of the video, I'm not sure. Wow, that is, that's a lot of vehicles. That's a lot of vehicles, guys. Very good stealth vehicles. So they no longer use the, the chain tankers, the tankers with the chain wheel. That is neat. Wow. So basically, these are new type of tankers. They've got wheel. Most likely, they are not wheel. They don't have air. Maybe they may be other ones which cannot burst. I'm not sure what it's called, but there are some wheels. It's on the president of the United States vehicle, the beast. The the wheels basically cannot get punctured, or they can keep driving even after they've been punctured, something like that. But these are basically tankers because they've got the the yeah the, the but I don't know what it's called. Though. But what the big not bullet, but what the missiles would usually fly out of. They've got them on there. See them? They've got them right there, so they are like the new tankers. Oh, that is amazing. <laughs> Yo! I've never seen a presentation like that before. Oh, here they are. Okay, they've got the chain. Okay, they've got either chain or rubber. This might be rubber, so I'm not sure. But here they are, the original type of tankers that, that we are familiar with when it comes to the army and, and having tankers. Of course, King Ramon the 10th and the royal family, members of the royal family present. That is neat. Neat presentation. Wow. The atmosphere though, I really wish it was a nice bright day. But it is fine, it represents, um, basically it fits well with the, the, the ceremony or the setting. That is a lot of vehicles. Wow. And of course they've got their hand across in some way. Wow. And they're moving together precise. And now we've got trucks. It looks like I mean trucks. Big trucks. So I guess that is what these are the trucks which will usually transport the soldiers. Or maybe different weapons. Wow. Yeah, so here yeah, some of the soldiers are on board. That is a good presentation, yo. Ay, wow. Look at the line of vehicles. Oh my goodness. Is this sort of parade presentation is new to Thailand? I mean, literally, you guys have never sent me requests like that from with King Ramad IX having an army parade like that. They are usually in the streets, um, marching towards a specific location. But that is a good presentation right there. And they've all got that yellow, green, and a red flag on the vehicle mounted. It's three different flags, but they're all together. Wow. I'm actually amazed. That is actually quite amazing. I mean, when I see a video like this, usually um, it's to do with Russia, China, you know, these massive armies. But here it is that Thailand, an awesome, powerful nation, have a great period like that in 2020. Look at the size of that one there. What is that? What? Yo, those are huge. Okay. The Thai Royal Army is quite impressive. They are bigger than I thought. They are more equipped than I thought. Wow. <laughs> Yo. That 
That is. I'm fiberglassing by this. I really did not realize that the Thai army is so very well equipped to so many, so many vehicles, um, army vehicles. Wow. And I'm quite sure there's even more. I'm quite sure there's a lot more somewhere at some military base or something. These are just the ones they decided to present or to um, use in the parade. What is the, um, not population, but what is the count for army members? How much do they have? Whatever, a thousand, ten thousand members, a million. Thailand have over 67 million people. So that means the army most likely has to be very, very big also. That has to. These are some cool vehicles, these right here. These are some good ones. I like to see those. I like to see those. It's like you can drive those on the on the streets. That's so cool. Wow. So these are all the vehicles in the parade. Let's see if I want to see if they're gonna have the, the uh, army men and women marching also across the region. These are some high ones. These are for rivers or, or very um, deep waters. <laughs> this right there, they're high. Wow. I must admit they're very disciplined. Driving precise. Wow. Kingdom of the tenth and the queen present. Way, way, way. That is beautiful. That is extraordinary. Well done guys, thank you for this request, thank you for exposing me to this video out from Thailand. This is a great presentation right there. Wow. These are the tankers, yo, these are massive. Wow. Have Thailand been at war with any, well maybe not at war, but had to use it military recently to defend any territory or anything like that. Let me know in the comment section. I've got a few videos to react to the war and um, how Thailand, um, what was Thailand's position in the war. I've got a few videos. You guys have, I'm not quite sure if it's because of the spirit, but I've got a few war or military videos out from Thailand. Um, I think I've got like three more videos or something. But that is a neat presentation. Neat. I just saw someone running behind the trucks. Wow. Very good presentation. Very good presentation right there. That's neat. That's awesome. I want to see the, the matching of the band now. If they're going to match, not sure. Shh, they're standing there so neatly. Wow. And normally, when you're driving or matching, you're supposed to have a rank you're supposed to match off of. So if it's the left, you have to ensure that you have a slight glance to the position of the left or the right and um, keep in line with them. Okay, so now it looks like they're going to do the, the, the army men presentation. Wow. Remember the ninth. 
Lion King, I'm at a 10. Wow. Most likely it might be singing the national anthem of Thailand. Only there's an a Thai army song itself. You <laughs> that is a huge army. Wow. That's a nice presentation there. Oh, King Ram at the time found the queen, of course, of Thailand. Woo! It's, 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 it's a flags coming up at the back there. Wow! This is neat. Wow, nice, lovely, Woo. boom. That is a good presentation right here. Of course, the military Thai Army Armed Forces Military Parade 2020. Wow. Amazing Thailand and a very powerful Thai army. Wow. Boom. Boom boom. <laughs> wow. That's a good presentation here, of course. Very good presentation. ส่วนสนาม151นายกำลังพลส่วนสนามยานยนต์955นาย So guys um yes um this um don't seem like they're gonna do the matching part in this video so if you know there's a video where they had actual matching also and salute leave a comments below just mention something here so that's King Rama the tenth and Queen leaving the, the podium. Oh, so maybe at that moment that they went in the vehicle and drove in front of the army men. This might have been at that moment, most likely. So rather than the, rather than the army men match, they'll be in the vehicle and driving in front of them. Wow. Ooh. Okay, so yes, so they have been a vehicle. So they went on the vehicle to depart the same. So they don't usually have security vehicles in front of the royal vehicle. From the here, I'm seeing the yellow vehicle and of about five other red cars. So it's like the vehicles are following. Usually, you will find their vehicles before. Well, in America, at least, their vehicles before the um, president and after the president. But Thailand is such a peaceful place, I don't think there, there's a lot or extreme need for extreme security. Wow. 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 
that's a neat presentation of course guys thank you for requesting this video as i said if there's a video of the actual matching um the tyrell i mean matching or doing um salute presentation to king on the 10th leave a comment below it was a great presentation a lot of vehicles more than i expected there are more persons than I expected. Of course, also let me know what's the count of the Thai Royal Army. Um, I know Thailand have over 69 million persons, so most likely the army would have to be like either 10% or, or something. 10% of 6 million is, oh, that's a lot. 10% of 67 million is, is uh, what, 670,000? No, actually, no, gosh, no, 6 million, 700,000. What is the count for the army? I really want to know. Let me know in the comment section, guys. Because if it's not 10%, at least let me know how much in the comment below. Thank you so very much for requesting this video. Subscribe, like, and share. If you want me to react, of course, leave a comment below. Bye, guys.